Hey guys, what's up? We all are very much aware of the laws of motion and also we know that it was given by Sir Isaac Newton. Yes, we say this because we have studied this since our childhood. But this is not true. Keep watching the video till the end and I'll prove it that the laws of motion were not actually discovered but were stolen by Newton. Welcome to Technical Tree PVP guys and you are watching Laws of Motion Stolen by Newton. The first, second and third laws of motion are this, this and this. But who actually gave the laws of motion? Let me tell you about the real discoverer and founder of these laws. Guys, he was a great scientist, philosopher and Maharshi of ancient India. He lived sometime between 6th century to 2nd century BCE. His name is Maharshi Kanad. He established a school of Hinduism known as Vaishya Sikh which was rooted on the base of metaphysics, epistemology, logic, ethics and soteriology. His traditional name Kanad means atometer and he is known for developing the foundations of an atomistic naturalism Indian philosophy in a Sanskrit text Vaisheshik Sutra. His text is also known as Kanad Sutra or aphorisms of Kanad. He in his Sanskrit text Vaisheshik Sutra has mentioned the three laws. The first one was Vega Nimitta Visheshat Karmano Jayate which means the change of motion is due to impressed force. The second one was Vega Nimitta Pekshat Karmano Jayate Niyadik Kriya Prabandhet This means change of motion is proportional to the motive force impressed and is made in the direction of right light in which the force is impressed. Third one was Vega Sanyog Vishesha Virodhi To every action there is always an equal and opposite reaction. Guys, now let me tell you the three laws of motion were published in 1687 by Isaac Newton in his mathematical principle of natural philosophy. Let me also tell you that in 1601 the British East Indies Company started sending ships to Spice Islands to gain a share of spice trade. Later on the British East Indies Company gained the right to set up trading posts along the coast of India. Later some of these trading posts would grow into major cities such as Madras, Bombay and Calcutta. But why am I telling you all this? Guys, because in this period of time only, the English scientists came to India for the research purpose and as they called themselves the atheist, they were not prohibited in reading and learning from the Hindu scriptures. And in the same manner, when Newton found the Sanskrit sentences written in Vaisheshik Sutra, his urge of knowing the things took him to the real meaning of those sentences written in Sanskrit. Happily, he went to his country and filed the patent for the discovery of laws, taking the whole credit by himself. That's why the discovery of laws of motion by Newton was not actually the discovery but was the rediscovery. And we can say the laws of motion was stolen by Newton. Guys, please like and share the video if you like the content. And subscribe the channel to know more about the new things every week. Thank you.